Hello friends. How many times have you gone camping and you permanently have ants climbing onto the table, having lunch with you, and you don't want those guests? Do you know how to get rid of them? Well, there are many ways. In shops we can buy some uh, white powder, special poison for ants. We put them around the ground and the way we see the trail of the ants or where they burrow, uh, so on. But the thing is the ants, they pick up the, the poison and they don't die right away. They go on walking, walking and get into your food and maybe they bring the poison into your food. They're not only eating ants, but you're also eating poison. The other option are these, these sprays that we spray them on the ants and the ants die immediately. But not all the ants, just those that you sprayed on. Then the ants keep coming on, keep coming on, and you keep on spraying and spraying, and it never ends. I'll show you how to end the problem once and for all. Very simple. Let's say, imagine this is the leg of your table, and the ants keep creeping up there around to your food, especially in the honey. That's what a horrible thing to eat honey with ants in it. If I ate honey with an ant in it, it wouldn't be so bad. But with ants, no. Well, the solution is quite simple, really. We have to get a cup like this. And here we cut out a circle of the same diameter of our legs. Now, if our legs were square, we would have to cut out the square. If uh, they are long and narrow, we cut out long and narrow. Now. Let's imagine our table has these legs on it. We're going to cut out a circle of a diameter similar to this. Once we've cut the circle out, we have to cut along the side down to the the hole. And then we can put it on to the leg. Okay, what we have to do now is tie a ring around here. It can be made with wire, with string, with wool, whatever you prefer. The thing is, you have to tie it tightly there so we can leave our cup in that position. What we have to do now is get some silicone. It doesn't have to be a gun and a tube like this one. We just need a little bit for the following. We put silicone around the ring and we also have to put silicone in those parts that cracked or were cut to be able to put it on. We have to cover all those cracks with silicone. Then up this cut. Now if you want, you can hold this in place while it's drying with an elastic or a bit of string, but it is not necessary. We have to put enough silicone to cover any crack, hole or cut we have made here, because eventually we're going to put water in there. We have to wait at least 30 minutes 
because silicone forms a crust over its surface in about 20 or 30 minutes. When that time is over, we can put in about one finger of water there, and that would be enough at least to start the process of catching any ant that climbs up there. Hmm? In eight hours, the cure is complete. Uh, silicone cures completely in eight hours. And then we can fill it with water up to the top if necessary. Now, this we have to do it on every single leg of the table. If the table has three legs or four legs or five legs, it doesn't matter, whatever. Each leg has to have a cup on it. Hmm? Otherwise, you know the ants are very bright, very intelligent. They'll come here, they'll climb up and pour in the water, and then there's one ant that's going to say, Hey, 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 they're all dying, they're drowning. Come on, man, go and find another leg, one without a cup on it. And they go and climb up this leg without the cup on it, and go and eat your food, and... No. You have to have a cup on each leg, and then that's the end of this problem with ants. Now... We can do this on beds, on chairs, on anything that has legs on it. And this is the solution for getting rid of ants while we're camping on the beach, in the mountain, or anywhere surrounded by nature. Well, I hope you liked my video. If you did, please give it thumbs up, share it, give me your comments below. And subscribe to the channel, of course. Okay? Well, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.